Hello YouTube world, it's me Janelle here and I am back with another video. Why else are we here? And as you can see from my face, I um, only have my eyebrows done, I have no foundation on, no nothing because today I am testing out a couple new products. Now, uh, my foundation isn't new but, uh, ooh this one's a little tight right here. My foundation isn't new but, um, I got a couple new things from ColourPop, so I did order the um, the Perception Perception uh, by Shayla. Um, he right here, she's here on YouTube, and this is the Mar palette. Also, this is a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. So here are the colors in this one. Right up my alley. I do like colors. Um, like I said, if I'm gonna wear makeup. I tend to go all out. It's just my thing. And then here's the one from Shayla. I'm pretty sure everybody and their mama here on YouTube have this or seen this or something. Um, I waited a really long time to get this palette. And it was on sale. So I got it on sale. But I wasn't sure if I was going to get this palette or not. Um, just because I have a lot of palettes and I don't really need it. But... I was debating between this and the Kathleen Lights palette and I was like, well, I'll support Shayla, another woman of color. And no offense to anyone, I'm not, you know, whatever. If I had a choice to choose, I, I chose her. I mean, that's my choice. And it's not to offend anybody or anything like that. So let me just put that disclaimer out there. I am not here to offend anyone. Everybody has their preference. These colors look very similar to um, Kathleen Lights. So I just figure I'll get the one that you know that I would support and that's what I would support so today I think I might just use this palette and then save this one for another day and I give you guys some swatches of this one um, I think I'll just use this one today just cuz it's not as talked about here on YouTube well not not as much I, I don't think and it's, it's so small it's like really cute so it has a huge mirror like you guys can see that and the colors are interesting so let's 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 just jump right into it let me stop talking so i'm gonna go ahead and use my um ulta beauty concealer and this is in tan warm i'm just gonna use this to prime my lid If you can hear talking outside, it's my neighbor. He always comes and stands like right under my window. I swear to God. So. Yeah, I hope he's not too loud. Like I hear him every single morning. He walks his dog. And then he like. Comes stand under my window and talk to his wife. I don't know. Like I guess. He has no other window window to stand under, so mine's win. <laughs> I don't know. The whole entire neighborhood and he comes under my window. Anyway, let's stop complaining about my neighbor. He's actually a really nice guy. So I'm setting the concealer with the air spun. Like I say like I tell you guys, and I'm using this uh, wet and wild brush. The um air spun powder, I don't know. Like People rave about it, but to me, the scent is just so strong. And then, I know you guys can see the white cast. Although, I'm obviously, I'm going to use um, the palette. But, not sure what I'm going for, but something's telling me to use this blue in the middle. So, let's roll with it. Let's see what happens, okay? So... Yeah, so for that first shade, I took the brown shade, which is called Sherbert, and I'm going to use that in my crease. Um, I was trying to tell you guys that I think that I may have had a little bit of product on my brush from prior, <laughs> but because um, the color came out a little bit more red tone than it looked in the pan, so... Anyway, um, I still think it looks pretty good and it blended out really, really nicely. So, yeah, that's all I'm doing right here. 
left in my gums. But I wanted to speed through this part because, I mean, you can clearly see what I'm doing without me having to slow it down or anything. Yes, I'm just blending out that crease color, a.k.a. transition color, because I use it for both in my crease and in my transition because there are only three mattes in this palette. And then um, I went straight to the darker color, which is the brown, the darkest brown in the palette. So yeah, I'm using that to deepen up my Art of V as well as bringing it into my crease. The thing about this color is it wasn't like picking up as bright as I wanted it to or as pigmented. So I just kept like pretty much dabbing it in like um, and like stamping it in into the corner and then slowly blending it into my crease because it wasn't giving me the color range that I wanted. But anyway, that's all I did for this look. And then for my lid, which is coming up in a few, I use the gridlock. Gridlock, which is the blue shade. That's going to be my crease. Yeah, I'm ahead of you guys, but um, that's what I use in my crease. And then that's about it. Just continue to blend, blend, blend. Make sure you blend that real good. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Hey guys, so I am back with the finished look and this is what I came up with using, oh my god, I keep making my braids look super tight. So, anyway. So this is what I came up with using the ColourPop Mar palette. Um, so on my lid, I did use that gridlock shade. And that's that really pretty blue one right here and then on my water on my lower lash line I did use that green I just wanted to see how it look how it perform and also this blue uh, let me tell you guys this green is really bomb and I didn't wet it I just use it just like that um, and the blue is really 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 pigmented so as promised I'm gonna go ahead and like I am the worst at doing swatches but Wait, before I do that, let me give you a rundown of what I'm wearing on my face. I am wearing my Wet n Wild foundation. And this is in the shade Toffee Pecan. And I did use this Wet n Wild Real Techniques brush to do my bronzer today. Which my bronzer is the NYX uh, Matte Bronzer. And is in Deep. So this is what I use. Um, for my lashes, I am wearing the Lily Lashes from Sephora. And it is in the style what style is this London 
and uh, my concealer I did a mixture of the makeup revolution and tan warm sorry makeup revolution and Ulta in tan warm and in C12 and for my powder today I did use a color pop um I think it looks actually I think it looks really good so I'm not sure how good it's looking on camera but in person it actually looks really really good and I really like this powder so far so good I don't know how long it will last but so far so good as well said but it's small it's real small but it's nine dollars so I don't know um I, it's honestly it does remind me of the what's the other one that I use um can't think of it right now uh Sasha Buttercup. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of the Sasha Buttercup. Um, I don't know. if I wouldn't trade one for the other, basically. I would use both of them. And, yeah, I think that's it. On my lips, I am wearing the, um, the Fenty lip gloss, the Rihanna one. So, yeah, I decided to do a real glossy, neutral, noth nude, nothing out there since the eyes are pretty darn bold. I feel like I've created created this look before. But anyway, so let me just go go ahead and give you swatches. Oh, and my inner corner, I am wearing El Rey, which is this one. But let me just give you real quick swatches of some of the shades that I did not use today. Some of them are kind of crumbly. So I didn't use three shades today. But I'm still I still want to give you guys a swatch of the blue. Look how pigmented that blue is. So these are the shades. Should I even swipe them on my hand? Sure, why not? That orangey gold, like some bronzy shade. Oh, that blue. So those are the ones that I didn't use. The rest of them are on my eyes. Actually, let me go ahead and show you guys what that green one looks like as well. So you guys get a feel. This palette, all in all, is like pretty good palette. Like one of ColourPop's better palette. Um, here's the green. That's that green right there. So, honestly, I like this palette. I would definitely use it again and again and again. It's, you know, it's very summer. <laughs> um, but like I said, there are no rules to makeup. So you wear whatever you want, however you want. Like, nobody can tell you how to wear your makeup. You do makeup however you feel fit. It's, it's a personal preference. Um, so... I have this other color pop palette right here. This is the My Little Pony palette. And in comparison, it's super crumbly. And this shade actually reminds me of the other shade that's in the palette. And then let me see one of the matte shades, this one. So this is what these ones look like. I don't really like I don't really like this palette. <laughs> like I had I probably have only done one look with it and never reach for it again uh, this one I would more likely reach for the shades perform better they're a little bit more buttery more smooth and the color I like so yeah so so all in all all the new things that I used today the ColourPop powder the palette the lashes this brush um, I think that's all the new things I would give it all a go like two thumbs up for me for all of the stuff that I used today that are new because nothing disappointed me so that's all for this video i hope you enjoy uh i hope you like my content please don't leave without subscribing stay blessed be beautiful peace